For Muslims, the month of Ramadan is not just about fasting or giving charity, but it's also an opportunity where we can actually improve ourselves and develop ourselves, especially in terms of building our character. In this video, I'll be speaking about how you can, during the month of fasting, the Ramadan, can actually develop your own character, which is the key factor in determining your style of leadership. Hi, my name is Dr. Nasser Ali and I'm about empowering people, especially young people, with a special focus on three pillars, leadership, innovation and communication. Now in leadership, it's very important that you have good character. If you want a long, sustainable leadership style, then it's important that your character is in order. And I always tell the young people that attend my young leaders club i always tell them that on a, on a daily basis they must work on correcting their character and there's a lot of work that's been written about character led leadership style there's a book here a uh, very good book it's one of the best sellers the character edge leading leading and winning with integrity so it's important that you have a good character and you lead with integrity. Only then your leadership style will actually will be sustainable and you'll create more impact. So there's a lot of work that's been done and uh, it's understood that character is a key factor. Now during the month of Ramadan where we are fasting and it's not just a fast where we don't eat or we don't drink it's also a fast of the of the eyes and fast of the ears and fast of the of the feet so you don't do anything wrong and one of the things that we learn during this month of ramadan is we learn more self discipline we discipline ourselves we learn more patience we become more tolerant and when you're dealing with people and you've got patience and you you show more respect and then what you're doing is you're improving your character and more people will find it more better to deal with you they will like you more your likability will improve and which is a very very key factor especially when you want to enchant or when you motiv motivate people or influence people so these are things that in leadership are very very important and because during the month of Ramadan we're, we're on a spiritual journey to uplift ourselves and develop ourselves spiritually also we can we work on our character and how we deal with people and because we tend to give charity we give to the poor people we become more considerate we become more compassionate we become more caring for others and that's what leadership is about where you care for other people's needs and you provide for other people so we do this for the whole month of 30 days the month of Ramadan and in 30 days you should be able to develop a habit so if you've been caring for others if you've been respecting people you've been more considerate and you've been more patient and respecting people and you've done that throughout the month of Ramadan for 30 days then hopefully you should be in a position to develop that habit and not only in the month of Ramadan you can develop new habits but you can also quite easily drop some bad habits so all in all in this month in the 30 days of Ramadan you can work and it's an amazing and an excellent opportunity for you to correct your character and you can work on the character and this will help you when you go on to lead teams and people and organizations because this character will give you the edge and with that you will do things you'll become more ethical and ethical leadership is a big need for that and uh, to create impact is very very important that you work on your character and you embark or when you have the opportunity to lead to lead with character based leadership style 
So remember, this month of Ramadan is a month of fasting, it's a month of giving charity, it's a month of self-personal development and it's a golden opportunity to correct and to perfect our character.